intelligent answer. Okay, so endorsements are great. Endorsements are saying, I think this person has a skill in this area and I just click it and it's done. You don't have to really know the person that well to give an endorsement. They don't have to know you that well, but you've seen something that they've done. It's a very nice thing to do to give an endorsement. It's like in Facebook, similar to liking their page. Okay, then you look at it, but on, on your LinkedIn page, a way to know what people think about you is to look at your endorsements. So then, you know, top, top skills, these are the things that people have <coughs> endorsed uh, me on. And, and it just gives a chance to see, maybe you don't want so many endorsements for some area. Are, can you control endorsements? Pop quiz. Can you control endorsements? Yes. That's true. Give me one way you can control them. Very good, Lawrence. In your profile, you can you can control how endorsements come in. Okay, good. Now, go down a little farther. We're going to talk about recommendations. Okay, recommendations, which start right there. Recommendations are much more powerful. Recommendations are almost like having a letter of reference for employment. So, rec and a recommendation takes time to do. You've got to actually write out something about somebody there, it has to have some meat to it, some real value to it. I'll tell you a story of the power of recommendations. Six years ago, I was interviewing for the job at Cobb Technologies, where I work now. And I was, there are other people who wanted the job. And I remember coming into the final interview when I knew it was the point of hopefully them choosing me and, and also me choosing them, because I wanted to be a partnership, not just a job. And I laid out 12 letters of recommendation on the conference room table before they all came in. I had all these recommendations laid out. I had 12, and I got them straight from LinkedIn. It blew them away. They didn't know what to do with that because they didn't have to call references. They didn't, they, you know, of course they did, but they had 12 people right on the spot who wrote really great recommendations. So I, didn't, I would encourage you to use recommendations. They're very, very powerful. Take the time to give one first. As Jim Roman will say, givers gain. And Jim Roman is great about that. He gives first. So I encourage you to give a recommendation to somebody who you really feel that they deserve it. It's a good thing to do for them. It's more powerful than an endorsement. And then sometimes they'll give it back. Sometimes they won't. Don't be concerned about that. Okay, so these are recommendations. All right, now the next thing I want to talk about is how to get more appointments through LinkedIn. So go to the top of the page. Uh -huh. Top of the page. This is, uh, you can sort of you know, keep on going. To get more appointments, just like our panelists talked about, you've got to research LinkedIn. You've got to look for, these are all the places that I've been and all that. You've, you've got to research and find the people that you want to meet with. So there's something called InMail. Who's heard of InMail in LinkedIn? Okay. Those of you who have free LinkedIn, do you use in? Oh, I got a question. Those of you who have free LinkedIn, do you use InMail with free LinkedIn? No. No. Yes. Well, Zach Rear? Yes. Can you? Yes. No. no. Free email? Yeah, don't you can't use InMail unless you pay. Oh, it's been a while. I've this is a man who's been paying for six years at 1999 <laughs> a month. Yeah. It's a good investment. InMail is fabulous. What is InMail? Well, InMail is a way, have you ever tried to get to the person who makes the decisions in the company you're reaching out to? But their gatekeeper, somehow your email never gets there. It happens. Okay. There's a better way. Pay the $19.99 a month and get InMail. You get three InMails a month for the basic entry-level business LinkedIn um, fee. Okay, so, so now you've got three in mails a month. Now what if you send all three and no one responds? Are you done? No, LinkedIn actually will credit you back if no one responds within seven days of an in mail that you sent, you get that credited back toward your three. Did you know? So in mail is a good reason to pay the nineteen ninety nine. So that's one way to reach people. Okay, another way to reach reach out to folks is through groups. Groups are an excellent way. We've talked about groups be a discussion leader, be a knowledge expert in the groups, and you'll gather people that way as well. Now, another way to reach people is, we talked about a lot, it's, it's really tough being forced, 
because we've already built this foundation, but I'm just going to build on it, is if some change happens in the company that you're trying to reach, set it up so you can have automatic updates. Did you know that you can have automatic updates for companies that you're following that you'll get a message of a change in the company? Who knew that? Anybody remember Anybody knew that? It's true, isn't it? That you can follow a company, you know how to follow a company, and then you can get automatic updates of changes in that company. Well, that's really good. When they hire somebody new, when somebody comes into the position that you're trying to reach that you didn't get to the person before, that is a great way to catch up with people through those automated updates. Okay, my time is just about done. I am easily findable in, in LinkedIn. If you want to connect people, have a really, you know, have a good picture of me that I was as, as ugly as that guy, but, you know, have a really good picture of yourself and a good background and a link to your website. So that was, that, that's been talked about there. That's, that's really all that I have for now. I want to leave plenty of time for questions and answers at the end, but just to close, endorsements are really good, and I encourage you to do endorsements. Recommendations are really powerful, and then take the time to research in LinkedIn, and you will have more quality appointments with people. Thank you.